Okay, to start out with, we have our cake that we baked according to the instructions on the box. And I have my mixer, and you can just use a bowl and a fork to mix all of this up. You don't have to use it, although it does make it a lot easier. So we're just going to cut this into big chunks. And place the chunks in the mixer. If we can break them up a little further, it'll help with the mixing. Okay, now that we've got about half of it in there, I'm going to put on the mixer and we're going to kind of break apart all of these pieces. Okay, now we're going to add the rest of our cake in there and mix it up. Okay, now we're going to add our frosting. And I'm starting out with two-thirds of a cup and we can always add more. And now we're going to mix it up. Okay, now that we have it mixed, we're just going to take our spatula and slide it down the sides and make sure it's all kind of a uniform consistency. Now we're going to get a spoon and we're going to get our lightly greased baking sheet and we're going to form little balls and put them on the sheet. And they're going to need to be a little bigger. We can just form them into balls. And it's just going to depend on what you're trying to do. Let's see, this is probably a really good size for what we're going to be doing. And if they're not sticking together very well, just add some more icing. Okay, now that we have our cake balls ready, we're going to put them in the refrigerator for about 20 minutes. So I'll see you then. While your cake pops are in the refrigerator, we're going to melt the candy melts and get them ready for dipping. So what you're going to do is take about half of it and pour it in a bowl. Make sure that it's microwave safe and you're going to put it in the microwave for 30 second intervals until it's melted and make sure you stir in between because they do burn really easily. Okay, it's been 20 minutes and our cake pops have been chilled. You just want to make sure that they're cool enough to where they're going to hold their shape. So we're going to take one of these lollipop sticks and these are six inches and we're going to dip it in our melted candy melts and stick it through the center. Okay, now we're going to take this and we can dip it in here. We can kind of spoon it around it so it's all covered. We can kind of swirl it till it's kind of smooth on there. And I have some sprinkles here that I'm going to sprinkle on top. And I have some styrofoam here. It's just the gardening kind and I put it in a loaf pan to keep it from tipping over. And I'm just going to sprinkle these on here and then I'm going to stick it in here to dry. Okay, they're all finished. Thank you for watching. If you would like some more ideas on how to decorate cake pops, stay tuned and check out my channel. Thank you for watching.